guys, good afternoon and welcome back to my channel. For those of you who don't know me, my name is Orla. And today myself, Kerry and the two kids off camera are going to try a snack surprise box, which is from Spain. And I just want to say a very warm welcome to all my new subscribers. I know in the last month I've had over 100 new subscribers to come on board and join. So very warm welcome to yourselves and a warm welcome to everybody returning. So a little fun fact for you, we lived in Spain for five years before we moved back to Ireland. So my kids are very excited to have a look at this box from Spain because they're hoping it will include some of their childhood treats that they sort of didn't think they'd ever get again for a while. So I'm going to just dive right in. I'm going to get Kerry to open them. We'll share them around and we'll give you what we think of them. So Kerry, do you want to open the first? Boca bits. Boca. Do you want to show them? Boca bits. One of the most popular snacks in Spain, these crispy salted wheat snacks are flavoured with a meaty goodness. And they are Lay's, which again is a Walker's, um, I believe it's the same. So that's what they're like there. It's like what we used to get down in the park bar. Speak up. It was like what we used to get down in the park bar. They used to cover them in um, a lemon and pepper. No, that's not them. They were plain Lay's. They were plain. I just got your bags of them. It feels like the peanut ones from the front box. Yeah, they're very like the peanut ones from the French box, that's I'll right. Put okay, we go for the next one. We do crisps first, yeah. just to get them out of the way. Okay, these are Cheetos. Pandilla. Pandilla. Cheetos presents this bag of crisps in ghostly shapes with a delicious cheese flavour that are crispy and delicious. Do you guys remember them? Yeah, mm -hmm. but we used to have the balones. Yeah, the balls. There's something wrong with my ghost. <laughs> you think your ghost is <laughs> <laughs> Mine is losing legs. <laughs> but very mild. Spanish. It's very Spanish mm. cheese. But a very mild I cheese. I remember those. Do you remember them? I used to get them in the, the, the like, Chinese shops. Mm. They used to be like really cheap. Sorry, just to explain. The Chinese shops in Spain used to be the equivalent to like... um your pound store your pound shop or your euro shop here we used to be able to get everything it was a real excuse me as my father used to call it a real old hookster shop you went in and wanted a rat trap or you went in and wanted flowers you could get everything and everything in between potato oh. frita so gamon so this is potatoes with ham flavored i presume i just can't find them on here but Fried potatoes actually... with one of the most popular and characteristic, characteristic flavours of Spain, ham. Persif they are super tasty according to this. They're um, prosciutto. You used to see it in the shops with the big leg. Oh, they're like the cured ham. To, yeah. It's the cured ham. Okay, you have to open it. Oh. Okay, I'm just going to have a small one. Mm. Will we move back to Spain? Yeah. I'd move back to Spain oh, tomorrow. Would you move back to Spain? Yeah. The temptation is so real. Oh, those are incredibly nice. Actually, I remember when we were um in like the park bar, they used to have loads of different crisps, mm. and they would have like a very wide. They variety. liked the crisps in Spain. I have to say, do they have any plain ones in there? Not that I can say. I've got jumpers. Oh, okay. This is oh. <laughs> yeah, butter. so good. Butter. Hmm? It's butter flavor. Can yeah. I show them up? Yeah, they kind of are similar to palm bear. They are butter flavoured corn snacks with char shaped jumpers. It's butter flavoured that will make you not want to stop eating them. Yeah. I don't have a hard They're, job not stopping them. When we used to get butter flavoured things, it was kind of like palm bear. Mm. I used to find those in, in Spain. It used to throw me off because the butter in Spain was white. Yeah. Where in Ireland it's quite a yellow creamy colour. Where in Spain it used to be really, really white. Do you remember them? Or you still like them, Cal? I feel like I'm back in Spain. Oh, we? Really? I just said to Kerry, would you move back to Spain? No, try it. We'll see would you move back to Spain, yeah. Haley? These are what you've got in school. I'm moving already. It's kind of like popcorn, but like it's not po it's popcorn without the curdle. Okay. Yeah. Oh, Don't eat them up. These two are off camera, and the crisps keep going that direction, and they're just in front of them. So they won't make it back this way. Like okay, last packet of crisps, I think. <laughs> oh, I'm 
Right, here's here's a question. Would you move to if I said to you I want to move to Spain tomorrow, would you move? We have an option, you're my mother. If we're thinking logically We could go live with your dad. If we're thinking logically for school, what are the situation I'm in right now, I would say no. Well you've got exams this year, yeah, obviously. So I would like, say no. What if, you'd if, say no, but we say your exams are finished, would oh, you yeah. move to Spain? I would like in to transfer, the morning. I'd transfer college and everything. If I was like if I was finished secondary school I would. Carl, would you yeah. move back to Spain? Of course. I yeah, don't hot. Hot. I don't dance. No debts in Spain. Also, all the spread wall online, anyway. Pays with them like on my yeah. game and feels so good to keep in contact. You with move. Yeah. I'd move. Don't say it to Grandma. Yeah, she should be gone. We just need to watch this. <laughs> <laughs> Where did it go? No. Okay. Oh, sorry. Just I opened it before even. So these are the original. These are fried corn chips with a barbecue flavor that you won't be able to resist. They are crunchy and tasty. Oh, they're so good. They're actually my favorite. Okay. The little just crinkly ones, so if you can see it there. When it says barbecue in Sprint, it doesn't mean barbecue like you're drinking, like it's. It's on a sauce. sweet barbecue. Smoky. Mm. I think that's all the crisps. I feel like I get a lot more crisps in Spain. Even though I actually go known for their crisps, I feel like Spain's the jumpers are going to be gone. That's the one thing I have noticed is the bags are actually quite full. We did get a few bags that were really, really empty. The German one, I think it was. The German one had like the Netherlands ones. Netherlands. They don't need few. Very, very I'm these. Well, no. Uh -huh. Oh, those things. Palmeras do. A crunchy. You take them out and cook them. A crunchy puff pastry topped with a deliciously sweet sugar glaze. Try one with your morning coffee. Of course. Oh, we have no morning coffee because it's no morning coffee. Do you remember you used to go into Mercadona and you used to they used to have all the pastries lined out and you used to just buy as much and we used to get the big bags because oh. Granddad when he used to come to visit used to eat like tons and tons and Here's tons of cake. This wasn't planned, it just broke this way. Oh I've got food there. Apple. I am having so many flashbacks of like sitting in out in the courtyard at the back of the house. Yeah. Sitting there with a cup of coffee in the mornings. Then it was hot. Mm. It was oh no! Oh, oh yes! Oh no! Oh yes! Filipinos! These are these, um, well, that one with the description. I'll give you now. Crunchy biscuits bathed in real chocolate to create a delightful taste and texture. Available in white or milk chocolate. We've got we got white chocolate. White, I like white chocolate. Look at all those crumbs going to oh. waste, Kerry! Salud. You used to be able to buy them in a little twin pack. I used to put them into your lunch boxes. It's funny how food tastes and textures invoke such strong memories, isn't it? Like you taste something and it takes you back to the park bar or Yeah. And because we were so young, this would be the stuff we would have been eating anyway. Mm. You know, it wasn't like we were eating sweet and veg. How old were you when you moved to Spain? Six and you were five. Six yeah. five and you were ten. And just turned ten. We and we came back when you were 15. Yeah. I just turned six and called just turned five. five. He was on your back. I was the same age. Oh. I, care what I, was mm. I didn't realise what it was because all I kept seeing on the side was like, no, free. Baby. Beepas. Oh. Beepas. Beepas. Bane of my life. Okay, these are our sunflower <laughs> seeds. I should read them. <laughs> I should read them, but we know what they are. So, and what they do is they, um, oh, we... You bite them, and in Spain you just spit out the the seeds. But no, like, the covering, the coating of the seeds. It was like a talent to do it without your hands. They were the bane of my life. These toasted sunflower good. seeds with almonds. Sunflower seeds, pipas, are commonly eaten snack in Spain. Oh, they are. They were divine. Mm. No, just took off the soft one. I absolutely hate, and I just hate the fact that people bite the crunch off, they get the nut out, and they spit out the thing. And it's the spitting. I cannot do. We used do. to have used your ashtrays. Yeah, I can't do <laughs> spitting, and I just it makes me gag. So crunchy wafer bars filled with milk chocolate and covered, filled with milk chocolate and covered with milk chocolate and rice pieces. Perfect snacks. So that's it there. It's like a milk bar. Mmm. 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 Oh, we, we didn't eat an awful lot of chocolate in Spain. We mostly ate like, like 
sweets it's like um, gummies. Mini you know, pizzas for the one your bag. They were gummies though, they were all jelly. One your bag, remember? Oh. <laughs> a typical Spanish sweet. These are a mixture of strawberries, eggs and cheese. <gasps> Children and adults just adore them. I remember on your one year bag. Does you guys take something and give the bag to us? Yeah. That's <laughs> 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 oh my god, the spiders! Do you remember the spiders? Oh no. The oh. Sarah Kerry? Oh! No. Um. Yeah, maybe. <laughs> um. I thought so much it was sour, it was like blackberry. It's really bitter. It's not sour, it's bitter. Okay. It tastes like um, do you know blackberry concentrate without any water? Oh really? Yeah. Can you stop eating all the crisps? I'm sitting here watching you eat all the crisps so I can oh, yes. oh, oh, yes. oh sardines. I love sardines. Yep. But the chocolate. Mm. Oh the, the chocolate sardines. <laughs> oh, so why are they giving us a tin of sardines? Sardines. You yeah. love sardines, Haley, and a tomato sauce. Called the salty so these are want... fish shaped chocolates, are packaged to look like a can of sardines, a tasty cho chocolate twist on a Spanish favourite. Can I Absolutely. say something? I like extreme sour and extreme salty, but I don't like extremely sweet stuff. Stop eating all the crisps. In, in Spain, when you used to work with tapas, they used to put out loads of different dishes, and one of the dishes they put out would be sardines. <laughs> oh, it's so cute! Oh, it's really like solid, solid chocolate. Mm. I wish it was like um, chocolate with salt in it or something, like salt yeah. chocolate. So like, it's meant for kids. I mean, that's just a cultural thing. Yeah. Okay, let's move on. Look. Okay, well, I'll explain what this is. This is like a roulette. A roulette wheel. A roulette wheel, but individually cut and then mm. smothered in chocolate. And it it's is like very a nice. wheel. And the cream on the inside is different. It's like a sponge, it's like a roulette. Yes. With a cream going through it. But the cream's different. I don't know. Yeah, well, it's not it. fresh cream. Yes. Carl. Oh, I'm coming, I'm coming, I'm coming. You're so special. You're just like it's Oh, oh. Still can't find it in here. Mmm. It's. Mm. <clears throat> To me, it's kind of like. Champion. There it is. Ah. I, know it I actually have a memory. I think this is a classic slice of Swiss roll yeah. filled with cream covered in delicious chocolate. That looks nothing like the picture that's in here. Is anyway. it called? Oh, tell that memory. Is. Oh, sorry, Carl, you have a memory. Go on. Coming home for Christmas from Spain, going to uh, them to go away mm -hmm. for Christmas. A bag of pieces you have like, <gasps> to give to your granddad. Yeah. That's all <laughs> we need. Remember that little cake? I don't remember eating those. It was like cheesecake, but it wasn't cheesecake, mm. but it was just cheesecake flavoured. That's what that was. Oh, I remember, yeah, I used to bring back the bags and go, yeah, have Merry Christmas. <laughs> and they were nearly 20 euros, the bag of cakes we used to bring so back. Many. But they never melted, never seemed to go off. Right, I'm, I'm just debating here. Just pick. Just one. pick. Pantera <laughs> Rosa. <laughs> she used to buy the big pack of them. She used to buy multiple packs of them. Do you remember getting these in the A delicious sponge cake with a cream filling and pink covering. It's <gasps> favourite among children and adults. Yes, it is. I adore these. I absolutely I adore these. these. You just had 20 of them. Mm. I remember. Do you remember going to the Met and they used to pick what a piece? Yeah, he used to, have, they used to have the big wall and they'd all these individually right, done. You guys going to have to split it. So and you, anymore, yeah. it's going to. You I'm just gonna take a bite and then hand it to you. Don't right? take too big of one. Oh, the smell of the pink. <sighs> this is. Eat it. I'm just so happy. Oh God! Oh, I don't want to eat it because I want to keep it. The smell it. Though, it probably wouldn't go off for like four or five years. Yeah. Yeah, those things lasted forever. When I went over to Clack Kerry after we moved back from mm -hmm. Spain, and I went over to Madrid, Madrid. to Clack Kerry. The only place I found was I found a market down and I went in and bought loads of pastries. <laughs> yeah, I remember that. Oh, oh my god. Even the smell of the pink like chocolate. It is it doesn't say the pink chocolate's flavoured. But it is. But it is flavoured like a raspberry or a strawberry, something very nice. So that's why Irish people like have rose flavoured stuff. Mm. That just made my day. I know that's why when I looked in the box because I couldn't see. That way I can see like over and it was just tucked in the corner and I was like, oh you're saucy saucy. 
You put them in the morning to give your whole day to be happy. <laughs> I was going to wake up to be like, oh. wasted in the evening, me being uh, happy. Okay, yeah. what are we going for? Con gu- con guitos. Con guitos. Con guitos. Con guitos. Con guitos. Yeah, monkey. Chocolate coated peanuts that have been one of the Spanish children's favourites across the generations. Now, children, you might not remember the packaging, but. No, I'm not. I don't remember the. Remember these? Mixed down. You, mother. Oh, oh. Ooh. You're a sadist. You used to mix these with raisins. <laughs> yeah. Who, me? Yeah, yeah. I used to put chocolate covered pe- peanuts in raisins. Uh, no, you have chocolate Spanish covered raisins. Used to as well as these. Say, mm. and for the school year, they used to bring out loads of these, but they put them in the bowl. Oh, we never like, saw the packaging, we just saw chocolate peanuts. Mm. Oh, mm. they're good. That's we have to go to go <laughs> I don't know what we're doing here. But this, what, why did we come? Why, why did we move back to Charles? I could, could tell you. Could, so, Kerry, do it. Junior, so. Plead the fifth. No, we have to come back because Kerry had to do the junior search. Because she didn't finish your primary school in Ireland. Yeah. And if she didn't sit the junior search in Ireland, she would then be classed as a foreign student yeah. if we wanted to move back. Yes. Which meant entry into schools and stuff would be very hard. So she had to come back. So we actually came back. It's meant to be a three-year course, the junior search. And we got her into school in the October and she did her exams in the May. Yeah, that wasn't funny. No, it wasn't <laughs> funny. Well, we knew you could do it, so we just threw you in. Didn't you get a chance to think? I got my results. I did, because you passed. You did fabulous in the morning. Yeah. Right. I don't know why it took me in college to primary school in Spain. We only had, I only had two years left, and I'd be done primary school in Spain. What was I meant to send her back on her own? Dad was there. <laughs> okay, I'm I am. Anyway. That may have been an oversight on my part. Ready? Príncipe Estrellas. <laughs> we could have There is nothing stopping us going back. I mean, yeah, our whole exams. But then again, she Grandma could live with her dad though for the next three months. She finishes. Grandma can come up. Do not think we want to have a chat with Grandma? <laughs> this is our chat to Grandma. <laughs> Grandma, we have something to tell you. <laughs> We're only messing. We don't. Yeah. Yes. I can't find it, Gary. I'm getting so caught up with them. And I know my mother's watching. It's on the, the other. A sweet snack from outer space. It, it's really not, but yeah. <laughs> These are crunchy biscuits with milk chocolate and a delicious cream of milk. That with a cup These, of milk for breakfast. dude, were another level. You used to sit outside with a packet of these. On a glass of milk. Yeah. Go look out. You didn't sit with them. You sat no, with I know. Go look. Or the, what they used to do was they used to drop the pack mm. into the milk. Just the hide and mix it. And mix it. Oh, I like this. This is going to make me grow my own crowd. I like these two and I'm not a fan of white chocolate. But I think it's in spring. It's the white chocolate. There is. is. It's oh, it's very thin there, milk. Carlos said if he wasn't dehydrated right now, he'd be crying from happiness. <laughs> <Aww>. <laughs> I'm so happy you are enjoying them. Watch, Mum. After I finish my leaving so August, watch n- new video. We moved to Spain. <laughs> <laughs> no. Actually, I have a few loose ends to uh, tidy up, so it'll probably be October. Yeah, yeah, until August. Happy. These Happy. are bright red candies that feature a crunchy, sugary outer layer with a soft, gummy cherry centre. Everybody loves them. <gasps> Brown ones. <laughs> yeah, so this is what they look like. Do you see that? Doesn't matter. Kerry, don't throw. Yeah, I don't know if you can eat. I don't want to. I don't remember what these. this. I think they're all the same flavor. It I just says what? bright red candies <gasps> that Should feature a it? crunchy, oh, sugary oh, oh. outer layer with a soft, right. gummy cherry center. <gasps> Bite the soft. The soft do you want one? No, I don't want one. <laughs> Will you stop eating crisps? All I can hear is you crunch. You know when you get the chupa juice? Yes. Yeah. And there's the gum in the middle. Yes. Yeah. That's what it tastes yeah. like. Okay, Carrie, do you want to get something else? I have these. Original and iconic soft candy sticks with an unmistakable taste and texture. Your box can include cola or strawberry. We got one cola and two strawberries. I got the cola one. Yeah. I remember these kind of, they're kind of like what we have. We didn't really get these though. We also got a loose end candy. I had one of these in my lunchbox, I remember. 
I left them on those. They remind me months. of the sweet though we have here. We have had them in the sweet. I love the flat cola. Lacacitos. A plastic tube containing milk chocolate chips covered with a thin layer of sugar in seven different colours. I think they're going to be the same as Smarties or not Smarties. Yes, yeah, Smarties. And the top of it, it literally just says um, security protection. One Smarty. Oh, 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 Right. Smarties. The Smarties. <laughs> They're just bigger. So before that, we have sour nuggets. <gasps> Tiny colourful candy pieces that are wonderfully sour and will delight only you in a wide variety of flavours. Not for you to I start eating. I was just as bad as him. You should ignore me. Carrie, mm -hmm. grab up the butter ones. Jumps. <laughs> right, that was actually full. Mm. Up to the top, we were just commenting, weren't we, on how full they are? Mm. <laughs> That's what we're left with. <laughs> Don't look at those ones. <laughs> <laughs> That's just mean news to you over there. Stop, oh, carry are they sour, baby? Do not that, but can I have the end of it? <laughs> <laughs> She's broken. Oh, at the end. Someone <laughs> broke Harry. <laughs> I was so sick. Help, help, please. Oh, that's like a bad word. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> My whole jaw tends to look like I do nothing. Who's taking breath? Yeah, all right. It's after going up my nose. <laughs> it's going into your brain, man. You <laughs> don't have a nerd in my brain. You've got a sour brain. That, we have this. Is that it? We can all no. share you. We're family. Oh my god! Look what it is! Do you really think I can see I the house? Castle. Castle. Lila! Gasserera. 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 you put the car. Oh, my eyes are actually over. Okay, you're going to pick out something else. No, you got to uh, The easiest way to get over something is just to move on. Oh, oh my god, god, I remember those! Melons! Melons was too big to cry. Flavoured with melon, these oh. chewy bubble gums have a delicious sweet and sour centre. Oh, My too. kids love these. I guess I'm going to touch two pops of These melon flavoured gummies. Before we start, I want Hayley and Carol just to smell the bag. Oh my god. Una para ti. Mm. Well, kids, mm. I'm ready. Oh, come on, Aiden. It's pouring out! It's <laughs> <laughs> Are you as happy? Mm. Mm. You're happy that we did this box? These are all just sitting chewing at me. Oh my god, I could. Oh, it reminds me of Feed Bus. Mm. Do you want eggs? Mm. Mm. Nice. Okay, Kerry, can we move on? Ta-da! Fumble it down, we might lose it. That's it! Ta-da! Oh no! <laughs> Not the shale! Oh man, Nicole. This is like tonic water or a very, very mild... Sprite. Sprite. That's what, uh, that's what the memory is to me. We're going to try. We used to use it for everything. No, it's not even Granny it doesn't remember this. She no. used to come and bought these by loads of them. And Granny, we used to have it like Sprite. It was like fizzy water, but... Lemon and very, very Did we just have them in? I never saw the can, so. It wasn't mm. tagged. Oh, we bottles. just got them in bottles. Plastic bottles. Big bottles. Yeah. No, well, if you they're got like a two litre, litre. they were like a litre or a litre and a half. half. I just they were the nerd. <laughs> Sorry. Those watermelon gums are so yeah. good. Yeah, we used to drink it like every day. Oh, the we drank. It's like, it was like fizzy really water. Flat cream soda. No, it's like very fizzy water oh. with a hint of lemon and lime. Oh, that was worth away. I got that before Christmas and I had to hide it away. We would have devoured it. Oh. We're devouring it. Yeah, we're not even waiting for the video to be over. Oh. I didn't even um, really realise that those melons were specifically just Spain. Mm. And mm. I never clicked in my head. I never was like, oh, where are those melons? All right, guys, we are actually going to go eat these all this. We're going to finish off these snacks. They're not even, we're not even going to stand up and pretend that we're going to put them out and eat them later. We're not, we haven't even had dinner. But we're just going to devour the snacks. Yeah. So thank you for tuning in. Thank you for spending mm. your time. with Oh, Kerry, you want to say something? Yes, I do. I would like to thank everybody, fellow lads, ladies, and the non-binary daisies for their support in me getting 
in the job interview, I have obtained the job. job. I got the job. There was so many people when I'd mentioned it on the video that had come out and said, oh my God, well done, Kerry, or tell Kerry, you know, good mm -hmm. luck or whatever. So I got the job. Thank I you. Start in, and thank you very much. And I start in two weeks. The manifesting is on God, my manifesting. You know, um, can you tell your viewers to manifest me 580 points for the leaving song? <laughs> manifest you. <laughs> Queer request. <laughs> can you send prayers, lights, and leaving cert points <laughs> to <laughs> Hayley? She's sitting her leaving cert. She missed 10 weeks of last year's schooling. She has missed, obviously, back in lockdown, she's gone back onto online learning. And she's just, after being upstairs, me and you were doing it together, weren't we? We were doing college... Mm. college application forms to do sorry Carl's trying to sneak his, his <laughs> so we are going to go we are going to finish off these enjoy our memories have a great chat about Spain and I will talk to you again in my next one take care of yourselves bye bye and each other bye bye ciao adios